normal versus shear stress. Let's look at a rod like this. We have just a rod of some length, L. We have a force applied to it, and the thing gets longer. If we take that force and take a cross-sectional area perpendicular to the force, then the stress on that area that we cut is P over A. The stress is an axial stress, P over A. You'll notice the force is perpendicular to the area or normal to the area. That word normal means perpendicular. So our normal stress is not less abnormal. It just is perpendicular. That's a normal stress. On the other hand, the shear stress, we have some member, we have a force acting on the end. You'll notice now the force is parallel to angle, the area that we're cutting, the stress on that parallel area is P over A, P over HT. Since the force is parallel to the area, it's a shear stress. That is the difference between normal and shear stress.